Among the most exciting matches at Crown Jewel, Roman Reigns and the Usos are set to take on Solo Sokoa's bloodline. WWE announced the bout following this week's episode of Raw that a few seeds have been planted regarding what will happen between the two sides, but what if a huge surprise is being planned for this Saturday? Let's look at three possible finishes to the six-man tag team match between the two versions of the Bloodline at Crown Jewel. As things stand, Solo Sokoa's Bloodline outnumbers Roman Reigns and the Usos. Tama Tonga, Tonga Loa, and Jacob Fatu will all be at Crown Jewel, with one of the three at ringside. However, this added distraction might not be the only advantage the heels get following their conversation this Monday on Raw. It is certainly plausible that Sami Zayn will join the evil side of the bloodline. Solo is trying to get the former honorary Yusan side, potentially reminding him of Reign's manipulative behavior after a back-and-forth match at Crown Jewel. Zayn can make a surprise appearance and distract Roman Reigns. This would allow Solo Sokoa or Jacob Fatu to pick up the win for the bloodline 2.0. That IT will definitely be heartbreaking to see Sami Zayn turn heel. However, such a swerve would lead to some interesting possibilities ahead of the likely Bloodline War Games match. After all, he has widely been known as the master strategist. Zayn can appear to be on the new Bloodline side at Crown Jewel, before betraying Solo and evening the odds for the babyfaces. This would lead to Roman Reigns and the Usos finishing the job. Sami Zayn fits much better in the OG Bloodline, thanks to his connection with JUSO. The YET master may have felt betrayed following Ra, but the former honorary Yus may prove that he can be trusted. All he needs to do is double-cross Solo Sokoa at Crown Jewel. That being said, the dynamic between Zayn and Roman Reigns will be one to look out for. The Rock returned to WWE at Bad Blood after Roman Reigns and Cody Rhodes went over Solo Sokoa and Jacob Fatu. So, if he feels like it, the final boss can do the same thing at the end of Crown Jewel, however. This time, The Rock would need to impact the outcome of the six-man tag team match. Solo did say that his return at Bad Blood was part of the plan, so it would make sense for the Hollywood megastar to help out the new tribal chief, Sokoa, Jacob Fatu, and Tama Tonga could end up winning thanks to The Rock.